Hold on, let me take my glasses off. Let me take my glasses off on this one. What the hell is going on, everybody? What's going on, everybody? What's going on, everybody? I want everybody to share this because uh, this video will be flagged. This video, I repeat, this video will be flagged because everybody see the title, and I'm going to say this. Watch this. Here comes the here it comes. So I want to see who's coming on here right now because I'm about to blast. I, I'm about to let loose right now. I'm about to get flagged on purpose because it happened before. It will happen again. I'm I'm I, oh we. I, I want everybody to see this. Look at this. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna. I don't give fake news, y'all. I don't give fake news. Watch this. I don't give fake news. I don't give fake news. I want everybody to see this. I'm actually on the Uber Guys channel, and I saw this. Hold on, I, I saw it somewhere else. Oh, here it go, right here. I'm going to Uber Guys channel right now. And I want everybody to see this, right? And I'm gonna tell you why I'm saying this before I finish the video. Before I finish the video, you see the title: CNN have fake Negroes in their studio. I'm gonna repeat this: CNN has fake Negroes in their studio. These are some fake lame ass Negroes in their studio. I'm going to say that there's some programming that, and they want to call us sellouts. They are the biggest sellouts in the world. These oh, God, I, I want y'all to see this before I read. Listen, everybody, I want everybody to see this. I'm going to look. I got the computer right here. I'm going to give you all some inside stuff right here. See it in. Head sets out because I am ready tonight. CNN has fake Negroes in their studio. I know I'm going to see uh, Sess and Expired. So I've said it. They do. They have fake Negroes in their studio. And I'm going to be real with you. Okay. Y'all ready for this? So I'm going to show you this. I'm going to show you this. Hold on. Administration, this is ridiculous. Okay. And no one should be taking Kanye. Look at this. This this is this is a bunch of fake Negroes right here, fake Negroes right here. I'm gonna go and give y'all some real news right here. Look at this real news right here, real news. Okay, I'm gonna go right here, and I want y'all to see this right. All right, y'all ready for this? Everybody share this because this is real news right here. I'm right here. I'm giving y'all the inside stuff right here. To win over black voters before the midterms. I'm not sure he's using them as a prop per se, but what Kanye West has done with Donald Trump is what other people have done who've gravitated in his in his orbit, which is just shower him with adulation. For what reason? I have no idea. Um, but the, the, my issue with Kanye West is, is quite simple. Um, it's that anti-intellectualism simply isn't cool. Mm. Kanye West is what happens when Negroes don't read. Um, and, and we have this now, and now Donald Trump is going to use it and pervert it, and he's going to have somebody who can stand This lame-ass nigga right here. <laughs> Just looking at Scott. Lame nigga. I said it. I'm from the hood. Whoa, okay. So, <laughs> it's a Chris Rock reference, by the way. Scott. Dude, find you our identity. <laughs> Go back and watch the old Chris Rock stand-ups from the 90s. Uh, maybe, maybe, I will look that up. Right look at y'all. Hollywood. <laughs> maybe it'll work, Tara. Will it? I don't know. Work for who? <laughs> it's not going to work in the black community. Listen, black folks are about to you know, trade Kanye West in the racial draft, okay? They've had it with him. He's not the same. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I do, I do know that reference. I know that, oh. that that is an old Dave Chappelle skit. I know there that one. Go. I got and he's an attention whore like the president. He's all of a sudden now the, the, the model spokesperson. Yes. He's the token Negro of the, of the Trump administration. Whole ass nigga. This is ridiculous. And no one should be taking Kanye West seriously. He's clearly has issues. He's already been hospitalized. Hospitalized. Um, Y'all just seen that clip ahead of me, okay? I've done, I'm completely no filter, no holding my tongue. Shout out, Uber no guy. Fuck CNN. The fuck every last one of them that had the nerve to say Negro or this guy in the third about Kanye West. I need to ask each and every last one of you stupid motherfuckers. Hmm. What the fuck is you doing for the black community other than being on CNN selling yourself? Or just making yourself look good with your tie and have your tie tightened up? Or, or, or saying stupid shit like, oh, we're about to have a trade like it's the NBA when it comes to black and white. Trying to make our community look so damn stupid. What we need is people like you to get the damn, to get the fuck off of the damn, damn television ASAP, please. Because y'all sit there and y'all say that 
this dude Kanye don't know what the hell he talking about. Then everything I'm seeing that you talk about makes sense. That just shows how stupid some Said of y'all are. The fact that y'all complain about prison, then when prison reform comes up, you want to act stupid or somebody has to be the head in charge. All y'all worried about is who's in a position to fix the situation. Y'all don't give a fuck about the situation. Let's keep it real. Obama asked for all this shit. Y'all have been all, Kanye is a good man. But y'all so fucking fake as soon as you get on CNN. And since it's trending to hate on Trump, you're going to jump on dick too and hate just what along with it. Most of the real motherfucking people I know in real life, they not like you stupid motherfuckers out there. Whether they hate Trump or whatever. They actually could be logical. But logical, but what? Logical about some shit. Like, I'm, I'm trying to say this the right way, but it's just, my, like, I just watched that clip. That I just played y'all, and that just pissed me off. Because I'm, like, I'm trying to get out of this political shit. But the fact that people really think like this, y'all need to grow the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? Really? Y'all the people that's going to be raising the new kids, teaching the new generation, this, that, and the third. But really? when it's time to fix things like gang violence, when it's time to fix things Say like it. jobs in your community, or prison reform, or even just meeting with a president, y'all make it so damn deep, y'all damn nervous. worse than the damn KKK. Literally. I saw my, this is what happened when Blackstone read. My brother, I'm probably way smarter than your stupid ass is. Hell yeah! I don't have to be on CNN and all this, that, and the third to read, teleprompters, this, that, and the third, bro. I can get fucking money myself. This ain't, this ain't, this is not what happened when mm. black people don't read. Say my I nigga. I nerve to say the N-word on white fucking television. My fucking nigga. Idiots. Y'all think this shit is just a joke to disrespect the hell out of anybody? That agrees, not with just Trump, just prison reform, just the shit that this dude is standing on. But since y'all want to act like children, so fucking butthurt over 2016, we can't get the fuck over the fact that the president that was in office for two fair terms is not your fucking president no more, and now Trump is your president. You still can't get over that. If you can't get over that, you, you, you ain't going to be nothing out of life. You ain't going to be shit in life. Half the shit that y'all complained about and said that this dude Trump was going to do never happened. Never happened. I seen how y'all acted before the man was elected. The shit I seen some of y'all say about leaving the country. Whole time you ain't got enough much money to leave the state. Like stop playing the dumb shit and putting this stupid shit on television and making everybody think it's so left sided or whatever the hell it is. Whatever side y'all on, y'all on the wrong side. I know how to fucking read. And I've read today, damn. Mm -hmm. Like I read every fucking day. That's fucked and I don't up, ain't over. Ride dick and just, just just ride waves just because it's trending. Big. Nah, you see me talk about Trump. That's not fucking popping. That's not gonna get me more pussy. That's not gonna get me more money. That's not gonna do shit for me as a black person like that. This is the fact that I got enough fucking integrity that y'all lack, and I'm able to come out and speak when something really makes fucking sense. That's the difference about people like me and people like you. I'm not the house nigga. You are. I'm independent. Mm. I'm doing this shit. I'm not making money off of this. If anything, I probably make a gas, put a, a tank of gas in a, in a month off of this YouTube shit. I'm not on YouTube just to yeah. get a bunch of money because just to be a Trump cheerleader. Fuck no. Speak I got on. a fucking brain just like any last one of you, and I probably do math better than most of you. So don't ever disrespect my fucking intelligence, Kanye's intelligence. People that come on my show with intelligence ever like that again and go on white t television. Y'all y'all so sucking this race mindset and this, that, and the third. And yeah. how everything's so fucking sensitive. But you got these two black motherfuckers that go on CNN and use the N-word. Real talk. Real talk. Over speaking the truth. Listen, y'all. And say it and laugh. Don Lemon laughing. This, that, and the third. Now you tell me who's inappropriate. As far as I feel about CNN, fuck CNN, man. I'm out of here. Peace. He he's out of here. To win over. He's out of here. Yeah 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 yeah. See, let, let me reverse the camera real quick, y'all. You dig? And I'm gonna go ahead and reverse this camera. Yeah. Shout out to Uber guy from speaking the truth right here. Shout out to Uber guy. We 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 right here. We right here. Shout out to you, Uber guy. You know, because that, that you the first video that I saw. You know, what I'm saying? Look, CNN said Kanye. Oh, now Brandon Sanders, man, good. Good, good, Brandon. Go ahead and speak on it. 
Hey, Uber, if you want to come on, I can invite you on. You can go ahead and just just let me know, brother, because I, I, look, I'm on a rant right now. I'm on a rant right now. You know, you have to walk away. Or if, if you want to come on, if you, if you ain't busy, it, no, we can do it later. It don't even matter because this stuff is going to be hard. I'm saying something right now, too. You know what I'm saying? It, it's, it's like you try to insult our intelligence. You try to. But you can't insult our intelligence because we are intelligent. We are intelligent. These people are not intelligent. Look at these. Look at these lame, goofy dudes on here. They put these little goofy little house Negroes on there. I, I, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, Uber, if you want to get on, give me the green light. If not, we do it some other day. Okay, he said one second. Let me know. Put the thumbs up. Let me know when you're ready to get on. Uber can tell the rest. Uber guy, you know what I'm saying, from YouTube, man. It's on Facebook, man. It's, it, it, look, I'm telling you, y'all, you know what? I don't care nobody say I, ooh, we. Things are getting real out here. You know what? I'm sorry. I need to be, I ain't apologize to that. Because what the hell wrong with you? What the hell wrong with you? CNN only hire lame Negroes in their, in, their, in their studio. They only hire lame Negroes in their studio. And I'm, and I'm just saying, they would not put people like us via Uber and put lame Negroes in their studio. Look at these lanes right there. Look at these rides on what's happening and looking ass niggas on here. Look at that. The truth break the chain, and they don't want the chain to be broken. They don't want it. They don't want people to keep it a real. They want people to keep it in effect. See them keeping the effect so they get these two lame Negroes on there to call us out and say we can't read. I said, you know what? We, 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 Woo we, I'm telling y'all, this stuff is real. This stuff is real. If they don't let Uber guy on here, we have to do YouTube, man, in a little bit, whatever. You know, we don't talk about this, man. But this stuff, this stuff is real. This stuff is feeling real, y'all. I'm like, Trump says Kanye West is a terrific guy. They, they put the title. They play this game. They play these political games, and we can't play these political games. We got to be a step ahead of these political games. We have to be a step ahead. Of Uber, turn your sideways.